guys welcome back to church girls want to get married to say hi to my daughter alexia i had did a hair video on her about alopecia and you guys want more um i did mention in that video that i was going to do more videos it's just been really busy and you know with covid we've been home so i wanted to do another video and i just wanted to tell you guys thank you that video is almost three is over three thousand views thank you keep on keep on liking the video guys and watching and hopefully we can get to ten thousand views so again i just want to thank you guys for coming back to uh church girls want to get married too where I encourage Christian women to reposition their self so they can be found by their Boaz. And ever so often, we, you know, put a little extra stuff in there. So, again, this is Alexia. And if you've watched the other video, Alexia has struggled with alopecia, which is hair loss. Ever since she was 15 years old, she lost all of her hair. It took about three years to get it back. It came back. And if you've seen the book, Praying for Our... In Christ I Am. Um, it's a book of her with short a short hair. I had kept it short. And just so that I could get it to even out. And um, we were doing well for some time. And then last year, about around the fall, she started experiencing hair loss again. Ever so often, she would um, have a spot here or there. And we would take her to the dermatologist, with, which gives her... The cortisone shot, but last year just got really, really bad. Let me just show you guys. She don't mind. Do you, Lexi? No. Um, so, and there's already a video if you want to look at the video. So right here, um, as you can see, it's, um, it's, it's, it's a lot. And, but it's coming back, as you can see, I don't know if you can see, and today is wash day for her, where I give her a wash and a deep condition, and I usually go back and forth between a deep condition and a hot oil treatment. So this week, it and as you can see right here, her hair is starting to come back because this was really, really bald. Uh, we haven't been to the dermatologist since March because, you know, it's COVID since February. She would go every thir third Thursday of the month. And since February, we have not been back as a COVID. And for me, I just feel as if, if it's not like a real emergency, then I didn't want to come out of the house. And look, she has one little gray here. Uh, 25. She's 25. And so as you can see here also, um, see here, it's coming in. You can see the little, uh, what, what they call peach fuzz is coming in here. You see it's coming in a little bit here. And here it's coming in a lot here and um, um, right here you can see one or two um, it's coming in here and then in the back it's a lot in the back turn a little bit Lex and um, here you can really see it's coming in all of this was was bald and it's coming in here and here hold your head up a little bit and it's coming in really here so we've been really working hard to get it back and um in uh ending of last year she had a really bad breakout we don't know what it was on her face um it started with um ears swollen and um took her to the doctor we took her to the dermatologist and um they weren't sure what it was, and the doctor referred her to the allergist, who gave her more um, antibiotics, and so that was able to kick it out. We weren't sure what it was. She had a, just a really bad breakout. Took her to the emergency room, and the doctor said, oh, you have eczema. And I'm looking at the doctor like, no, really, eczema is not eczema. So the allergist thought maybe it was, it was, it was um, maybe like septic or something. So they weren't sure, but thank God the... Uh, the um, antibiotic they gave her knocked it out to God be the glory. So uh, she's going to start her deep condition. Um, I will do another video of her hot oil treatment. Again, I wash her hair every week before she had experienced another round of hair loss. I would wash it every other week because she was doing good. And then I would use anti-itch and I'll do another video of some of the anti-itch products. So some of you guys have asked some of the products that I use. Um, this was this was the first product I used, the biotin. I got this at GNC. 
um, somebody told me about it. And I had went to GNC and picked it up. So it's the biotin conditioner, biotin shampoo, thicker, fuller here naturally. And then it has like a, um, and I think you can get these on Amazon. I will link them below if you want to pick these up. Or they should be at your local grocery stores or beauty, not grocery stores, beauty, beauty, uh, beauty store. And so that was one of the first products I used when she initially started the hair loss when she was 15. And then, you know, the Dominican mommies. I love my mommies, honey. Soon as I can get out here, I'm going to see my mommy so I could get me a blowout. And I have one lady, Maria, who used to do uh, me and Alexia's hair. Oh, she could give me a blowout and she could blow Alexia hair out because I had stopped giving her perms just in case it was... Um, the perm that was causing the alopecia. So she would give her a blowout and her hair would look like a perm. So on the book, In Christ I Am, that blowout that she has, Maria did that. Okay. So this is um, some uh, hair follic anti-age and scalp drop. And I remember when she had lost all of her hair. I mean, every last one. She didn't have one strand. And the Lord spoke to her. I was praying. I said, God, tell me what I need to do for my baby. And the Lord said to me to pray um, in her hair follicles. So I would wash her hair back then every two days. And I would pray, hallelujah, in the name of Jesus. I would anoint her hair with oil. And I would command her hair to grow. And I would speak life into her hair follicles. And all of a sudden, right up here, there was one strand, two strand, three strand. And all of a sudden, she had hair all over her head and um she also had to wear wigs um i'll probably do another video of some of the pictures of the wigs she had to wear and then in 2010 i told her you know she had one spot i said you don't have to wear the wigs anymore and she stopped wearing the wigs at the end of 2010 so um also this i got this from the uh mom is honey soon as i can get out Soon as it's safe to go to the beauty salon, I'm going to get my hair blowout. Uh, this is the energizing treatment for fine and weak hair that has strengthened her hair. It's the alter ego. It also has an onion paste um, conditioning, but I ran out of it. And, you know, it's COVID and um, we ain't going nowhere. Okay. And the, the garlic. The gar it's a garlic paste conditioner. It's in a jar. And so this is the garlic shampoo, really, really good. And then it's the conditioning, um, conditioner also, really, really good. Very expensive. I do not use these products here. I do not use them on my hair because they are so expensive. I only use them with Alexia. I probably once in a while, maybe once a month, I'll do the drops in my hair. I'm all natural now, but even when I have had a perm, I would do the drops once a month and I only use a conditioner on her, deep conditioner and the shampoo on her because they're so expensive. Okay. So I use different types of biotin. As long as it says biotin, I use it. Um, I think I got this at Pilgrim Press or something. I just wanted to try their biotin um, shampoo and conditioner. It smells really good. Also, I, you know, whatever I find to use, I try to use it. So this is a black castor oil shampoo, replenishing shampoo, and then the biotin um, collagen conditioner. I think I got these at Marshalls. I love Marshalls. Y'all know I love Marshalls. If you follow my channel, I so love Marshalls. So I use these interchangeably. I do not use all these products at one time. Someone had told me that sometimes you're here, get used to a product, and so you need to change it. So that's what I do. So I might use... Um, maybe a product a month or every two weeks or something and of course the keratin i used to give her keratin uh blowout treatment and then someone told me that the keratin is what they use on the dead people here so she said mommy don't do that anymore do not use do the keratin treatment on her hair so i stopped the keratin treatment it's like a perm the mixture is like a perm but it's not a perm it's a keratin treatment and i just stopped using it but the keratin shampoo um is really really good and i think i got these at marshall see it has the marshall signs on sign on it i love marshall's and then the um keratin protein strengthening conditioner so these are all some of the products i use i will do another video with the what i use for a hot oil treatment for leaving conditioning for her I do have a mini beauty supply store at my house, as my girlfriend would say. But that's because I want to use all the products that I can possibly use to help her 
to get her hair back. Because you know, ladies, when when we lost her hair, it's just it's it's uh, traumatic. And so I'm just praying and believing God that her hair will. Come. I've been keeping her. I'll do another video of me braiding her hair and what it looks like. Of course, now because it's it's just a lot of um, patches and stuff, it's kind of hard to cover it. But before I would be able to cover it. Um, I'll also do another video with the hot oil treatment that I do for her and I do them every other week. So I'll, this week I'll do a deep condition and then next week I'll do a, um, uh, a hot oil treatment for her and let her sit under the dryer for about 10 or 15 minutes. I know some people think to say the heat doesn't work is not good, but ever so often I do sit her under there. Sometimes I just put, uh, Put it in her hair and just let let her keep a cap on all day and then i wash it out and um so i just wanted to share this video with you guys again i just want to thank you guys for for over 3k on the um on that other video i shared with her hair and i will do more videos because you guys are watching it and you guys want more so i will do more i will probably do another one with the hot oil treatment i'll probably just do that right now and just upload it differently so again here are the products excuse my little uh here it dries so old here are the products again the biotin i use biotin on her we also take the biotin pills the biotin um hair vitamins um the skin hair and nail vitamins um lexi you want to run upstairs and get the hair vitamins on your step um and i love these very very expensive but i love them they work um and then the black castor oil shampoo and conditioner and the biotin and the keratin and um so if you guys want to pick these up i will link them below on my amazon page be sure to check out my amazon page but i think also you can just uh use these at your local um your local um, beauty supply store, and also, okay, so thank you. Get one of your books for me with your name on it, the one with your picture. Uh, so this is the uh, Biotin. Um, we use this one is 5000 MCG. Um, I do trust this brand because I've been using it forever, so I feel safe having it. And uh, this really helps to, to kind of um, help her. So, uh, but I think any biotin or any hair, skin, and nail, the vitamins is good. And then, of course, this is the book I was talking about. This is a book I wrote for Alexia when she graduated high school because I wanted her to know and have something she can always go back to about her identity in Christ. As you can see with her here, I think we did this picture in 20. 14 I uh 2013 yeah 2014 um it took years for us to get her here like that but I would cut it I would bring her to the beauty uh, salon they would give her a shape up and they would cut it even it all the way out until um it just got to the point where it's prom pictures the one with your pink dress and I never I don't perm her here I only perm her here for Special. It's over in the dining room where I sit. Yeah. Um, for special occasions because you know I know she she want a perm. She want her hair to look a certain way. So I don't perm it. Um, the last time she got a perm was 2016, and so this is also available on Amazon. If you want to pick this up, if you want to support us, support Lexi. And um, this is a book I wrote for her, and it's about her our identity in Christ. And then this is a her prom picture. Uh, this is 2016, I believe. Yes, 2016. And um, here she had a perm. Um, she really wanted a perm. This She was graduating. So I, I went ahead and gave her a perm. And um, make sure I can get a good picture of it. But I think I have this on my Facebook page. So there you go. Isn't it beautiful? And so she had a perm here. And that's the last time she had a perm. You can see let's see oh there it goes there it goes there she's so pretty she's a pretty 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 baby she's a pretty i was not happy about that dress child you see all them boobs out i don't like it but she loved that dress all right guys so thank you for watching share this out if you can tell somebody about my channel please be sure to check all of my other content out 
I have lots of content, dating content, Bible study, uh, study the Bible in one year. I have another channel called study the Bible in one year. And of course I will link all of these products, um, uh, below. Let's go get my other books while we're talking about my books, the pink one and the, the other one. So I thank you guys for your love and your support. Continue to watch, continue to share this out. Um, any questions you can link them behind and I will uh, answer them for you. If there's any videos you want to see of with Alexia or her here, let me know and I'll uh, do it for you. Did you find it, Lex, over on my, that one, those two right there that you were just touching, those two? Yes. And just check if you don't mind while you're on Amazon. Just check my book out. Check my other books out, guys. Um, uh, this book is called The Naked Wives. Well, let me tell you about this other one first. Uh, 23 Tasks of Guys You Might Meet on Social Media. It is Choose Right. There's different types of men out here. Choose Right. And then the uh, 23 Tasks of Guys You Might Meet on Social Media. Uh, if you don't want to end up being the naked wife, you need to choose the right guy. All right, guys. Love you. Love you. Thank you for your love and your support. Say bye, bye. Lexi. Lexi is about to get her deep condition. Get up under there, Lexi. Ooh. Okay, let it go. All right. So I sit around there about 10 or 15 minutes and then she's good to go. All right. I love you. My blessings to you. And if you're dealing with the alopecia, you know, see a dermatologist and allergist and see what they can do. Love you guys. Bye.